The Mavic 4 Pro is one of the most anticipated drones of the moment, and as new leaks emerge, expectations continue to rise among enthusiasts and professionals in the field, who are eager to see what new features this latest version of DJI's professional series will bring. Recently, new information has surfaced, drawing attention to a hidden feature in the initial leaks, which suggests a surprising solution for the positioning of this device. So from now on, let's analyze these images and reveal the new details. We know that DJI is an innovative company, far ahead of its competitors, constantly surprising us with each new release. We recently saw this with the Flip, Neo, and Air 3S. This has created great anticipation that all these innovations will be incorporated, and even surpassed, by the new Mavic 4, as it is a high-end drone. As soon as the first leaks about the Mavic 4 appeared, they revealed a new concept from DJI, giving total priority to the camera, even if it compromises the aesthetics. This new trend became evident with the implementation of a large spherical camera that occupies the entire front of the drone. Technically, this is very interesting because it allows the camera to move freely in all directions without any obstructions. However, this solution also introduced some challenges, such as where the front optical sensors, or even a possible LiDAR sensor, would be positioned. The most natural solution would be to follow the trend adopted in the Air 3S, keeping this protruding front section of the drone. In this case, the Mavic 4's appearance would be more harmonious and similar to the current Mavic 3. However, with this radical change in design, the front of the drone no longer has space for these accessories. And DJI's engineering team had to use all their creativity to find alternative solutions to accommodate these sensors. This adaptation became evident in the first leaks, where the new arrangement of the optical anti-collision sensors can be clearly seen. They have been cleverly repositioned to maintain full 360 degrees coverage, ensuring that the drone can avoid obstacles in all directions. But won't the Mavic 4 have a LiDAR sensor? This was a mystery that lingered for several months, as despite having many leaked images from various angles, none of them showed any signs of a LiDAR sensor, since its camera occupies the entire front part, which would be inconsistent for a professional drone of this category. After the release of the Air 3S, this type of system became almost mandatory in DJI's new drones. It was a huge success and even won over the most skeptical, with its ability to enter complex environments and fly in covered areas, even without relying on the GPS signal. With the release of the Flip, this trend was confirmed. And although it has a simpler system, it has still proven to be useful, especially because, Regardless of the sensor, the heavy lifting is done by powerful artificial intelligence processing, which has evolved a lot in these new drones. Just look at the small Neo, which has no sensors, yet it can interpret images from its own camera and with the help of artificial intelligence, identify objects to determine whether they are obstacles to avoid or targets to follow. However, recently, this leak drew attention to a new feature that was supposedly going to be revealed soon. This feature was reportedly already present in previous leaks, but no one had noticed it. However, the photo associated with this leak shows the image of the Mavic 4's camera, which doesn't make much sense, since the most anticipated feature for this drone would be a LiDAR sensor. So I started carefully reviewing all the previous leaks to see if it was possible to identify any hidden LiDAR sensor that might be discreetly positioned within the camera setup, but besides finding absolutely nothing. I thought that it wouldn't really make much sense, because if the camera were pointing downwards and the drone were flying forward, the LiDAR would follow the movement and wouldn't be able to effectively detect obstacles ahead. But this mystery didn't take long to be unraveled because just two days later, this other post came out, showing an exclusive image. In fact, 
This was the first front-facing image of the Mavic 4 with the propellers in this position. The previous ones were always taken from strategically chosen angles, partially covered, showing only the back, in low resolution, or deliberately placed in dark environments. But in this image, new details can be seen, including the most important one, highlighted by this red circle. It shows what appears to be a display of a supposed sensor on the front of one of the arms. The text indicates that it is some kind of measurement system and raises a question. Could it be a LiDAR sensor similar to the one on the Air 3S? Or just an infrared system? In my opinion, it is certainly a LiDAR sensor. Following a logical reasoning, it would be a huge mistake for DJI to equip the Air 3S with a next-generation LiDAR sensor, and then put an inferior sensor on the Mavic 4, which is a high-end, much more expensive drone. Just out of curiosity, the DJI website confirms that the Air 3S indeed has a forward-facing LiDAR sensor, which the company also refers to as a 3D infrared sensor. This sensor has a range of 25 meters, even in low-light environments, and emits infrared light pulses in a cone shape with a 60-degree field of view. In the case of the flip, DJI does not use the term LiDAR because it has a simpler infrared system with a short range of only 8 meters, similar to the one used on the bottom of drones to measure altitude relative to the ground. This type of system is not new, as it was already present in the DJI Spark back in 2017. It had a range of 5 meters, and its performance was slightly inferior, since artificial intelligence technology did not exist at that level at the time. After researching extensively, I finally found the LiDAR sensor hidden in one of the first leaks. In that video of the crashed Mavic 4, it appears for a few seconds, but it's clearly visible on the right arm of the drone. I did some processing on the image, and it became easier to see the sensor up close. It also appears very discreetly in the leak that was published in December, but it would be hard to notice due to the poor image quality. However, now that we know where the LiDAR sensor is located, I enhanced the photo quality, and it became much easier to spot the sensor's bump. I even managed to notice that the camera is missing its front casing, where the Hasselblad inscription usually is. In my opinion, I found this solution horrible. The sensor is misplaced and breaks the drone's symmetry. This shows that DJI has put aesthetics in the background and prioritized technical aspects. As a fan of the brand, I was really surprised by this solution. Lately, DJI has been adopting questionable designs, and just last month, I made a video addressing this issue. Are we entering the era of ugly drones? I'm not questioning the quality of the product, because at their core, drones are nothing more than flying cameras. In the end, what truly matters is image quality, and in that, DJI is the market leader. Therefore, I'll continue to be a fan and loyal consumer of the brand. Leave your opinion in the comments, as I read all of them. If you liked this video, leave a like and don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Thank you for watching.